Hi, this is Robert Polenik, the owner of Brutal Iron Gym. I just finished up a great workout and I thought I'd share one of my favorite tips for muscle growth. Typically when you're trying to train a muscle to get it to grow, you, it's suggested that you train that muscle twice a week. The first time it's usually better to use heavier movements, more compound movements, and really aim for kind of sheer force overload on the tissue with weight. The second time of the week, it's typically better to do something that's more metabolic damage, more of a pump effect, a little bit more isolation, a little bit lighter weight, but you're still looking for a high intensity and a high degree of challenge. In this video, I wanted to share one of my favorite techniques to use for that second day when you're trying to train a muscle twice a week. In this video, I'm training my chest for the second time in the week. The technique is to use an exercise pairing that pre-exhausts the target muscle. So I'm actually doing cable chest flies leading into and paired with my dumbbell chest presses. So I'm gonna do a set of the flies right into a set of presses, and then I would take my break. This is also referred to as pre-exhaust. So you're trying to pre-exhaust, pre-fatigue the targeted muscle with an isolation movement before a compound movement. So I'm isolating my chest with the chest flies, and then I'm allowing other muscles to help on the chest presses to help push my chest further into muscular fatigue and failure. The benefit of this technique on the second workout of the week is that the isolation movement does decrease the amount of weight you can use for the compound larger movement. However, since you already have one heavy workout in during the week, you already have a lot of joint fatigue. So this technique allows you to reduce joint fatigue while still maximizing muscle tissue damage. So you would perform an isolation exercise before a compound exercise, and that is a great exercise pairing to use on the second workout of the week.